Hey everybody, we're just out here uh, messing with some of our water systems and uh, Jennifer noticed something here in this swale. Now, not everybody knows what a swale is, but generally speaking, it's here to capture water in what is essentially a ditch so that, that water can soak in to the soil. So rather than all that water running off down into a creek, we can soak it into the soil. Plants can make better use of it. And what the plants don't use still soak down into aquifers and we can recharge our aquifers. But they're also life systems. And unexpectedly, take a look at what's going on in our swale. The reflection makes it hard, but can you see them swimming around? We have got tadpoles in our swales that have only been here for a couple months. See all the little black tadpoles swimming around? Ain't that something? My friend over at Camelot Hills invested in some fly predators. Uh, which is a great natural way to try and combat flies. But Jason, it looks like we've got our own natural way of trying to combat the flies. Because if this keeps up, we're going to have a whole lot of fly-catching amphibians in short order. So there you go. There's an, uh, an update. We haven't done any kind of an update here on j, &J Acres in some time. But there's an update for you. We're growing tadpoles in our swales, in the food forest we're trying to develop in our front yard. Thank you all for watching. See you next time.